Hello everyone, welcome to Lessons 8. Uh, today another topic. Uh, last week we uh, study the Lessons 7 is about food. And today the Lessons 8, we are gonna study about apples, right? Fruits. How much apples per kilograms? 苹果一斤多少钱? Alright, and now we go for, as usual, vocabulary for this Lessons. Okay, the first six new words. The first one is the verb. My. Okay, read after me. My, which means to buy. Okay. 你买什么? What do you want to buy? Right. Next one. 水果. 水果, which means fruit. Right. Remember, uh, when you have uh, three tones standing together the first tone you need to transform transform it into the first tone right shui shui gua okay let me highlight here it will become the first tone shui gua all right and now we are gonna go for the next one ping gua ping gua which means apple right Pingua number four is a weight in China tin okay tin is around half of the kilos right around half the kilo but in this lessons I will try to make it equal to one kilo so you guys will understand it more easily right but actually tin okay one tin equal to uh, zero point five kilograms right gong tin kilograms okay kong chin number six is an adjective okay to describe something that is expensive gui gui okay the fourth term very short gui okay next one uh the next five words okay le le well this word uh has been used for many purposes all right and remember that uh love will be used differently in different circumstances uh you just need to remember you know in this uh one is a kind of mortal particle okay so you understand it when we go to, into the conversation all right now number eight ba ba okay uh a particle used sorry this one is a particle used okay a particle uh, used it, okay at the end of a sentence okay used it at the end of the sentence normally to kind of a suggestions right so we ni mai shui gua ba okay which means uh, you should buy uh, fruits uh, it's kind of a suggestions okay ba is like should in english okay now uh you will learn uh besides shema for the previous lessons what okay na where and now another way to uh, ask a questions is how much many okay tu shao tu shao okay how much right okay next one tu tu shao which means many and a lot Number eleven, uh, opposite to tour is few, little less, shao, right, shao. Okay, number twelve. Okay, uh, you will learn a currency. You you know renminbi, right? Is uh like uh in U.S. dollars we have renminbi in China is our national currency, and number twelve is a basic unit okay a basic money unit in china all right uh quite okay because in spoken uh, chinese we do not say uh, run mean p okay we not say quite all right next one uh there's another uh you know kind of less value uh, currency okay tiao equal 10 percent of quite okay smaller than that fun equal to 1% of quai. 
Um, uh, to this one, you probably, uh, you know, have some confusions, but don't worry. When you go into the lessons, you uh, see it. Uh, it's not too difficult, right? So when you use uh, Chinese money, all right. Number fifteen, hai, hai, okay, hai, longer, still on so in additions, okay. Piata, piata. The other, okay. Ni mai shema, piata shema, okay. When you want to ask others to buy more or what other types, but you do not want to mention again that the subjects, okay. Uh, another type of fruit is uh tuizu, tuizu, which means orange, right? Number eighteen, okay. You know. Duoshao, how much, how many, right? And this one, you want to ask others how. In Chinese language, we have zhen me, zhen me, zhen me, right? Okay. Um. Next one. Okay. We say mai to buy, right? We have to sell. Mai, mai. Okay. Very quickly. Mai, the fourth tone, right? Mai. Number twenty, um, you know, uh, when this kind of two in here is guys spoken, uh, Chinese language, okay, uh, you do you remember R right? R is a two, right? But when you use in spoken Chinese, normally uh, it's not the mobile phones. You say liang, liang qin, okay, two kilograms liang qin, right? Uh, next one is okay. 一共, okay, all together, all right. 一共, all together, 一共多少钱, all right. How much money all together? Okay, the verb 给, 给, okay, to give, okay, 给 somebody to do something, uh, do something for somebody, okay. So you know the this type of uh, grammar in the next few lessons, but in this lessons, just remember for me, 给, which means to give. All right, now number twenty-three, uh, the verb 找, 找, which means exchange and look for. Okay, 找, to look for someone. Uh, 找一个人, 找一个人, look for somebody. All right. Now, uh, one more time, I will go back and read uh such twenty-three new words with you guys. Okay. So first one, my, shui guo, ping guo, qin, gong qin, gui, le, ba, duo shao, duo, shao, kui, jiao, fen, hai, 别的，橘子，怎么？卖，两，一共，给，找。Alright, um, do you make it? So I hope you guys make it. And now we go for the conversation, the text. Right, this is the most important part in our lessons. How we are going to use all such vocabulary into the real conversation, right? Okay, the conversations between A and B. Uh, I ask, 你买什么? Okay, 你买什么? We reply, 我买水果. 苹果一斤多少钱? 我买水果。苹果一斤多少钱? What does this mean? 你买什么? Okay, 什么 which means what? Right? 买 which means buy? Okay, and uh, 你买什么? Okay, just ask what do you buy? Okay, I buy fruits. 我买水果, 水果 equal to fruits. Okay, and you will know how to apply it to use 
多少 in a conversation. 多少 which means how much. 苹果 apples eighteen per kilograms. 钱 which means money. Okay, 苹果 eighteen 多少钱 How much apples per kilograms? Next one. 三块，三块，太贵了，两块五八。Okay, what does this mean? Three yuan. Okay, 三块 Remember, 三 equal to three. Okay, just a little bit explanation for you guys. Uh, one yuan equal to around one point fourteen US dollars, which means one US dollars. Uh, you can get seven point zero eight yuan. Right, okay. So which means that, uh, with kind of less than US dollars, you can have, uh, th- you can have okay, a kilogram of apples. Okay, it's really, you know, cheap in China. Okay, 三块 but in China, uh, B explain. 太贵了 Okay, so when you want to express, uh, you know, your attitude, your Views that is so expensive, you should raise up your voice. Okay, 太贵了，太贵了 ，so expensive. Okay, 了 is kind of you know an expression. So now you realize that the word 了 ah、uh, is used in these circumstances to ex- to express your、uh, opinion, to express your view that is so expensive, right? And now ah、uh, be. Made a bargain, right? 两块五八 okay. Two and a half yuan, okay. Less than zero point five yuan, okay. 两块五八 suggestions, okay. Remember pa now. You put it at the end to make a suggestions for the seller, right? 两块五八 um, can it be two point five yuan, okay? And now uh, I ask, 你要几斤？你要几斤？我买五斤。要 which means I、uh, want. Okay, remember 要 T which means ah、uh, you know kind of the words to ask many. Okay, many. 你要几斤？你要几斤 ？Ten kilograms. 你要几斤 ？Okay. 我买五斤。Okay, remember. Okay, this one is the tone. When three tones standing together, make it the first tone. Okay, remember we have to make wa equal to wa. Okay, wa. 我买我买五斤，我买五斤。Okay, and now you can realize that there are three tones standing together, and always make sure that the last tone you have to keep it wu. You can make it. Two times like the first tone. Okay, you can say, 我买五千，我买五千 But you can say, 我买五千 Okay, is that's fine. But the last one always keep it as the、uh, original tone, the top tone. Okay, and what does this mean? I want five kilograms. I、uh, I want to buy a、uh, five kilograms. Okay, let me tell it here. I、uh, do not write here. Wo mai, okay, which means buy.、Uh, I want to buy. Okay, I want to buy five kilograms. Ah,、uh, that's good. And now let's see the next one. Hai yao bie de ma. Hai yao bie de ma. Qi zi zhen me mai. Okay. What does this mean? 还要别的吗 Remember, 别的 which means other, right? 还要别的吗 It includes the meaning of other fruits. Okay, 要 one, right? 吗 Put it at the end of the sentence. It will become a questions. All right. 还 which means still. Okay. Do you, do you still want other fruits? Okay. 还 which means still. Okay. And be ask. 橘子怎么卖 ？Okay, now 橘子 which means orange, right? 怎么怎么 which means how? Okay, want you want to ask、uh, how? Okay, you put 怎么
the ma plus okay the ma plus verb okay uh, the ma plus verb okay so uh, for this one The ma, right? The ma, which means how, okay? Uh, my, okay? Which means sell, okay? Uh, you will see some similarities between such words. My, 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 right? My, okay? You is shorter. My, which means sell. My, which means buy, okay? Okay, next one. Liang Kwai. Liang Kwai. Okay. Yao Liang Chin. Yi Gong Duo Sha Qian. Okay. What does this mean? Liang. Remember, we mean two in spoken Chinese. Liang Kwai. Yao Liang Chin. I want. Yao Liang Chin. Two kilograms. Yi Gong, which means all together, the total. Duo Sha. How much? Qian, duo xiao qian, how much money? Uh, I want two kilograms and how much all together? Okay, yi gong duo xiao qian. Yi gong xiu liu kuai wu. Ni gai xiu liu kuai pa. Gai ni qian. Yi gong xiu liu kuai wu. Ni gai xiu liu kuai pa. Gai ni qian. Okay. Yi gong, okay. The total is 16 yuan. Five chiao, okay. Shu, okay, which means ten. Liu, which means six, and you plus all together. Shu liu, which means sixteen, okay. Ah, uh, kuai wu wu, which means number five, okay. Ah, uh, chiao is the uh less value of the uh, Chinese currency, okay. Ah, ni gai shu liu kuai ba, okay. Ni gai shu liu kuai ba. What does this mean? Um, you uh just need to give me. Okay, uh, 16 yuan. Okay, 你给十六块吧? Okay, 你给, you give me just 16, sorry, you give me just 16 uh, yuan. Alright, and here you are. Uh, 给你钱, 给你钱, okay, 给你钱, give somebody. Uh, shu. Chào nín sáng sư sư khoai Chú sư wù sư Chào nín sáng sư sư khoai Ok uh, This is 15 yuan uh, Chú sư remember which means this is Right Wù sư which means 50 yuan Ok Chào nín sáng sư sư khoai Ok Exchange Ok I exchange you uh, Nín which means like another form of way to call Nì you right San which means three. Uh San Shu Tsu Kwai. Okay. So another mistake here gonna write one more time. Not sure this one. Chao Nin San Shu. Okay. Shu you know which is number ten, right? Chao Nin San Shu Tsu Kwai. Okay. San Shu Shu ten and two which means four. San Shu Tsu Kwai. Okay. Well that is for our lessons today. Uh, we have learned lots of vocabulary related to fruits, uh, some verbs to sell, and if you want to go to store, you now know how to talk to the seller, right? My, my. Okay, remember, my, along which means to buy. My, which means sell. Okay, exchange. Okay, give you back your money. I hope you guys find the lessons interesting. Uh, we'll always upload the lessons, you know, on a weekly basis. So try to uh, keep up with our channel and receive the latest lessons from Henry Chinese Han Yu Tiao Chang. Alright, see you guys next time. If you like these lessons, please click like and share buttons. Also, I'd like to know and hear your feedback. 
or if you have any questions, you guys can leave comments so I will know what your needs and improve the license to the best. To receive the latest lessons and videos from Henry Chinese channel, please click and subscribe button below. Thank you guys.